So people could be waiting for months and that's a combination of Seattle being a big pet city. People getting more pets during the pandemic and places like here the downtown dog lounge in Ballard that says they're having a hard time finding workers. Now they say they're receiving hundreds of calls and emails a week, all requests they've had to turn down. So the business operates three locations in Seattle and pre pandemic had up to 100 dogs in daycare and were at full capacity for boarding just in their Ballard location. Now they're operating at half that. Owner Elise Vincenetti says during the pandemic, they went from 93 employees to 13 and are starting to hire, but finding workers has been difficult and finding ones that, finding ones that can train and care for animals has been really difficult. The days of just going in last minute without plans, I'm dropping in for daycare, are really going away. We really have to be a little bit more conscientious about what our plans are for the next month. And it's not just Elise. The Elliott Bay Animal Hospital, just a few miles south of here, closed their boarding during the pandemic and says they're not staffed to reopen that part of the business anytime soon. Elise told me that she advises people to book early and to keep in mind that most places require an evaluation before booking. She says they're booked through September just for that evaluation. For now, reporting live in Seattle, Angela Cockaday, King 5 News.